y'all what's up it's your girl brandy Giz, and i'm back let me turn this up a little bit i can turn on some lights yeah so yeah guys i am what's up y'all it's your girl do i need this light on i'm actually just chilling right yeah i don't need it on but um i was just laying in bed right watching um a little bit of youtube and I was saying to myself, I've had this makeup on since, what time? Four this morning, it's like six o'clock at night. And I was thinking to myself, I need to wash my head. Cause I mean, I've been wearing these wigs and whatnot. And although they are so easy to put on, I need to um, wash my head. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna probably feel myself washing my head. This is. I don't even braid my hair anymore, y'all. I just put it in a ponytail. And I had took a shower and my hair was like super. Oh my God, I need to wash it. Yeah, so look at me. This is your girl. So I'm about to, I'm going to go downstairs and um, wash my hair. And I'll come back and blow dry it and flat iron it. And I bought a new blow dryer probably about, what, a week or two ago. I want to test it out and see if I like it so yeah that's what I'll be doing so I'm gonna film me uh doing my hair how about that then I got something to show y'all I got some perfume to show y'all yes your girl I actually went into TJ Maxx and Home Goods looking for a bed kind of like a duvet a cover you know to put in between the comforter and on top of the sheet uh I found one, but it was $69 and I refused to pay $69. So when I went into another store, I actually seen one on clearance. And right now it's in the wash machine being washed now. It was on clearance out of the package and it was a Vera Wayne. And she told me that the price was, when she came back, $18. I knew it was more than that, but it's worth it. It's so worth it. So I am super excited. Hopefully, I don't know, it looks like a queen, but it might be a, a fool. I don't want a fool, but hopefully it's a queen. So, um, yeah, I'm going to get off of here, wash my hair. I'm going to come back when, when I um, rinse out the conditioner and everything. Y'all seen me wash my hair and condition it. So I'll be back when it's time to blow dry and all that other stuff. But what was I telling y'all? Girl, yes. So anyway, I was minding my own business. I was looking for that duvet, right? Lo and behold, I went past the perfume section and I seen some perfumes. Y'all, I am so done with purchasing perfumes. I thought I was done purchasing perfumes. That's crazy. That's crazy, but I did get it for a dirt cheap price and I found my signature scent. I'm happy about it. And we're going to talk about it. We're going to talk about it. So stay tuned. Let me do my hair. And then I'll show you probably the duvet once it dries and whatnot. And I'm going to show you the perfumes that, excuse me, I had. I'll be back. Okay. So I just washed my hair. I conditioned it and it smells really, really good. The uh, shampoo that I used is from Prima Nature. It's this, but it's downstairs. This right here is a detangler. And the conditioner that I use is from, I think it's Aveeno Apple Cider Vinegar Conditioner. Yeah, and I put that on my hair. So right now I'm gonna just put some Apogee in it. Spray that in there. Now this is a Pro Vitamin Leave-In Conditioner. Spray that in there. My hair is huge. Look how big it is, like whoosh. Okay, so I'm gonna use a little bit of this, not too much. I like the smell of it, it makes your hair smell real good. So maybe like a quarter size and not too much, but just enough. Okay, and then I put on this John Frieda. This is the Freeze It Freeze. This is the extra strength serum for thick coarse hair. 
and it has bamboo extracts in it it helps with my hair you know becoming frizzy and I'm like running out I don't have much in here let me see if I can open it up and get it out dryer this is from Sally's I picked this up when did I pick this up on the 19th of January so almost two weeks ago uh -oh. and this is from Carnair my friend told me that this is a good uh, blow dryer she went to hair school and um, it's called the silver bird and I've seen another youtuber use it who is a hairstylist as well and the only reason why I got it is because the one that I have I don't really care for it, although it is the the chi version it didn't come with a comb attachment and I like I want to use a comb attachment I have thick hair and it also comes with this here nozzle as well it has I have thick hair and I want to um use the comb attachment so that I can get it in real good although I do like my dim and brush you know I like what I like so we're gonna so I'm gonna test this out and you're gonna see okay okay we're in business y'all we are in business now I need to get this uh, shower comb and kind of like detangle Y'all got these lashes on and I got them wet. So they looking a little crazy. And I'm going to play some music for y'all while I do my hair. right here it resists upon me and it is the diamond the red one so that's what I'm gonna use to flat iron my hair 
So I'm going to use this Chi Iron Guard. And a little bit of this.
love so i am finished doing my hair as you saw me i had transformed right before your ass yes i feel 100 percent better now i can rock my hair for a couple of days um i don't know i think i probably have another wig review um coming soon but it feels good to rock my um natural hair but anyway it just feels good to rock the natural tresses and you probably are wondering what i used on my hair the john frida didn't work for me because i was out okay so the frizz ease i usually use this to blow dry my hair because this is a like a anti-humidity pop serum that this is a serum that stops the frizz it says one drop frizz stops and it has like a powerful hair serums addressing all levels of unruly frizzy hair with ease and this is really good especially when you have natural hair like myself i'm not relaxed anymore but sometimes when i sometimes i want to relax my hair but then i realize i have color in my hair so i might as well just keep it natural because uh i don't know girl but anyway i use the chi iron guard at first which was cool. I just sprayed just a little bit and I went in with the Mazzani Thermal Smooth Shine Extend. Yeah, this is pretty good. This is an anti humidity spritz. And I need anything that's anti humidity because that's what helps not to revert my hair back to that curly stage or, you know, making it real big and stuff. So I'll be able to wear this hairstyle for a couple of days, you know and what else i want to tell you about the care care i really don't use that i tried to use it on my edges so that i wouldn't have to put any um gel just just a little bit and i also use this here design essential i know this seems like a lot of products but there's a method to my madness this, you know i'm just trying to use a little bit and try to see if it works and then i said nah um I just used a little bit of this and then to finish it off I went in with Olaplex just a like a nickel size you don't need a lot and just you know just give my hair some shine yeah some shine so this is my look you guys and I wanted to show you what I picked up I know y'all probably like girl what you what you done bought now well I went into Walmart and I seen that they had the elf ultra precise brow pencils and I already bought some from down here some from Alta right here but I like these pencils a lot the the uh, elf I don't like to spend $25 on the pencils if I don't have to I, I would but this works well for me right now it's been working well I have it on my brows I just put some on my brows because I had washed it off during the uh, shampoo process but I like this a lot. So it, the one, the color that I got it in is brunette. And I, then I brought some hair grease. I don't know if this is hair grease, but it says Bronner Brothers Double Strength Super Grow, rich in proteins with vitamin E, sage and sulfur, coconut oil, paraben free. And it just says like to apply to the scalp and massage. So, if you guys know anything about this, let me know. Let me see how it smells. That smell good. It smells like coconut. So, when my my scalp get dry, I'm going to put this on it. So, yeah. I'm a product junkie. Did y'all know that? Yes, I collect a lot of hair products. So, that's me, your girl. It is me. But anyway, um, let me show you uh, what I ordered. I was telling y'all about on last week. I ordered some perfume that I had a sample of and it finally came let me put it back in a, and it finally came you guys it finally came it is Killian yes I didn't get the big bottle yet I want to make sure that this is what I really really want and so far I'm in love with this yes I am yes I am I like perfumes that I'm in love with if I just like it I like perfumes that I love you guys and this is it right here I love perfumes and this is the bomb this is love 
by Killian. It says, don't be shy. It's an all day perfume. This is how it looks. Now this is the travel spray. And like I told you guys, I don't like roller balls. I like sprays and the packaging is really pretty. And as you can see, I didn't use it, honey. I ain't even had it probably for like three days. It smells so good. Oh yes, I love it. It has a, a sweet smell. Just I'm gonna tell you the notes so that those of you all who don't know about this perfume can know how it smells. So let's look it up. So again, this is Killian Love Don't Be Shy. This is the travel spray. It retails for $48 and it is a 0.24 fluid ounce. And I had to order it online. They didn't have it in the store. The fragrance family is the florals. It's not your average floral. It is a sweet, warm floral. The keynotes is orange blossom, vanilla, luscious marshmallow, and you smell all of it. And it just smells so good, y'all. So good. This is the bomb. I know in the future I will probably end up with the bigger bottle, but for now, I have a lot of other perfumes that I can play with or spray and smell good in bad skin so this is love don't be shy god this smells so good this is the kind of perfume that when someone smells you they want to hug you with this perfume although you shouldn't be giving out hugs because of covid but y'all know what i'm talking about and if you don't have this and you like sweet kind of floral smells like in between that marshmallow not that uh, candy sweet but you know just really nice and girly this is a fragrance for you this is not um the little girl not to talk about ugh, not to talk about a uh, homegirl aqualina pink sugar i don't have that much left in there but yeah this is the i'm grown now and i'm ready to you know smell good so this is really good and I'm gonna put that right there and I also went into Sephora but I'm doing good because I used to go on Sephora and spend hundreds of dollars in a second but I haven't and that's a good thing yes check out some old videos and you'll know those of y'all who know me I just I was just spending buying all kinds of makeup so I just buy a little bit of makeup now but uh yeah this is the Valentino and this is born in born in Roma this is the spray it is super cute I didn't buy the big bottle no I did not I don't need the big bottle at all and this is the packaging it's cute right pink y'all see that little I got a theme going on now I've smelled this before and I think um, I had a tester for it and my coworker loved it so I just gave her the tester because it just didn't at the time it didn't wow me but I said you know what let me revisit let me revisit Valentino I don't hear a lot of people talking about it but let me revisit Valentino and I did y'all I love this perfume this smells so good it's sweet but it has that floral note it just balanced it out it has a crisp clean intoxicating smell that i like and i'm going to show you what um what is in here now the small bottle is 75 dollars this here um i think i got it because i had a a little card and i also had 10 percent off because I'm an essential worker. I always try to use that child. And the the smaller bottle is 75. The bigger bottle is 130. The next to the bigger bottle is 100. But the tester, I always say tester. The travel spray is it's 30 dollars. But I think I end up paying let's see 20 something. That's the only thing that I purchased. Okay, see on here it says okay. So with the healthcare, it took off three dollars, and I had a gift card, so I end up paying like twenty six bucks. Yeah, 
the gift card was just a couple i spent some money and that's the residual that i had on there i'm talking too much but anyway this is the floral fragrance it's a warm floral it has black currant jasmine grandiflorum bourbon vanilla that bourbon vanilla smells so good and it's just the right amount it's not too much it is man it's so good it's just luxurious it's feminine and it's just blend it's, it's blended well so i love this i don't even want to spray it uh-uh i can't because you know i ain't got that much but these are the fragrances that i love and if you see me going shopping again for some more fragrances check your girl but i think i'm done i think i'm done okay so i went into home goods and i might show y'all i bought this little duvet cover it was on clearance y'all it was on clearance i went into tj maxx and they wanted like 69 dollars for it and i'm like this is crazy so i think i end up going into home goods and i found that but i found it on clearance it wasn't in the package and she gave it to me for 18 dollars. so i so happened to i was so glad i was like 18 dollars, and it is a um what was it it was vera wang and you just throw it on the bed they're not gonna see it because it's gonna be under your comforter but like when we sleep we just pull the comforter back and we can sleep under that this is a chatty vlog y'all so if you don't want to hear it, oh well just skip ahead but um what was i saying when i was in tj maxx i think i was in tj maxx let's see yeah i was in tj maxx oh. here's the little the bag i was walking towards the cover section and i glanced over at the cosmetics and you know next to the cosmetics is the perfume and i seen this perfume why i don't like mark jacobs like that now i've had daisy and some other mark jacobs perfumes i've given away because i just didn't like it but this right here honey i want to be quick because my battery about to die but honey i was like you know what it was in the plastic you know where they have it like secured and i wanted to smell it but i i didn't i couldn't smell it y'all and i was just thinking real hard while i was at the cash register and i and when she took it off i was like when she takes it off and it's not sealed in the plastic i'm gonna open it real fast she was like you want to open it up and smell it first like, yes so i opened it up and i smelled the perfume now this right here is a 3.4 fluid ounce and i've heard a uh i heard miss diva like talk about this perfume and this is the bottle it's a big bottle too let me get the top out it's cute too i like this this would be real cute on my yeah this is super cute look at that isn't that cute real big bottle and it was for 39 y'all at first when i sprayed it i was like oh my goodness but i let it sit i, I sprayed it on my hand like so and I let it sit and she was ringing up my stuff and I went back to smell it and I was like this is beautiful this is beautiful it's different from the Marc Jacobs because some of the Marc Jacobs like the Daisy for me gives me a headache it makes me feel like I'm you know how you have that hunger headache where you just didn't eat and it's like you annoyed that's what uh, Daisy did to me and some other fragrances but this one right here is a little bit different it just smells so good you guys it's like citrusy clean fresh has that floral and I like it so yeah I like this a lot so I got that and I already told y'all about this this one just came in the mail remember i told you i went to also i picked it up it was 84 dollars, probably about 90 with tax but it was online for 40 something so i took that back to Alta like last week and um this finally came in the mail same thing this is from angel this is the all chris i think i'm saying that right it's a real pretty bottle i showed you guys this it was like 40 
43 46 something like that so i ended up you know getting that and saving 40 dollars, which was good which was smart and then i seen this and this was open and it said roberto roberto cavalli and i always hear amber chanel talking about roberto cavalli but she she always talking about the Gemma d paradis somebody you know what i'm talking about and i was like let me look and see how this one smells this one right here let me just try it and see this is the bottle really cute right it sounds like it's real cute it's probably probably stink established in 1970 and it's forensic so i opened it up and i sprayed it on my hand and i waved it around and i let it sit while i walked around in the store to get the get that uh what is it called that duvet girl when i reached for the duvet and came down i smelled my hand I need to go back I need to go get that perfume this right here is everything it smells so good this is a 1.7 fluid ounce this is the kind of perfume it just smells so grown and sexy I love this it was like man I would never have purchased something like this but when I seen the price I was like I'm taking you home yes 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 i'm taking you home so that's enough about perfumes that is my little collection yes i'm not gonna be buying any perfume no time soon i might be telling a story i don't know you never know you never know i might come across a gem who knows but if i do i will share with you all i know some of you all are sick and tired of hearing about my perfumes but you guys know what to do when I talk about stuff that you don't want to hear, just fast forward or go to the next video, chat. I got all kinds of stuff for you to look at. Hair, wigs, vlogs. Sometimes I, I cook something. Sometimes I have family on. Who knows? I got everything for... I got a whole conglomerate of stuff. Is that a word? But anyway, so to make a long story short, short this silver bird was the bomb. I love this. It was a great purchase. I purchased it at where did I go? To I purchased it at Sally's and it was $44.99. I had a $5 off coupon. Although your girl shop, she does watch her coins, and I'm doing really, really good. Yes, I am. I didn't even spend my stimulus yet, so you know I'm doing good. With that being said, I'll see you guys in the next video. This perfume smells good. This one do too yes honey i am gonna go put all this hair stuff away and get ready for work in the morning so i'll see you guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video thumbs it up let me know that you enjoyed it let me know do you like how my hair turned out yes your girl is natural and um yeah i love y'all thank y'all for subscribing thank you all welcome to the new welcome to the new subscribers who's coming on board and the oldies that's holding me down that's staying in my corner we kind of like fuss and fight some of y'all be talking about me you know and throwing a little shade but i love y'all yes i do i love y'all and that's family family's not gonna always agree we can agree to disagree right so i'm gonna keep it 100 Yes, I'm going to keep it 100. I'm going to get off of here. I love y'all. And I will see you in the next vlog. Take care. Be safe, y'all. And um, lock your car doors. Because they doing a lot of carjacking right about now. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to cover ourselves with the blood. And i see y'all later. Bye. Okay, my love. So this is like the duvet cover. It is like an off-white. And so far i mean i love it it's from the brand vera wang let me see if i can yeah vera wang i um washed it and i fold it i washed it and i fold it and it had some kind of let's and it had some oh there it goes like stuff like this where it's like snag i'm cool with that for it to be and it's kind of it's not too thin and that's not too thick and i'm gonna put it on the bed and yeah we can sleep under this instead of my husband always trying to sleep under the cover the comforter so 
so yeah i felt like i scored and i'm about to upload this video and get off of here i said i was getting off of here this is a long vlog i hope it ain't too long but yeah i'm getting hungry i was snacking on these chips from where did i go i went to target they got these uh these chips let me show y'all pretty good these are the honey barbecue with a cold glass of water what you talking about all right y'all let me get off of here i see y'all bye